by the way, my name is David and this is It's a Pop Thing. Thank you guys for checking me out today. I seem like I'm always doing videos late at night when I've worked like a thousand hours in one day and I literally uh, worked that much today. Yeah, I know it's only 24, but trust me, I worked a thousand. Anyhow, I hope you guys are having a great weekend. Uh, well, start of your weekend. And um, so you guys can do some ECCC Pop Honey. Uh, which I have been doing the last couple of days. Um, I wasn't that enthused about what was going on um, with some of the ECC pops. Um, I kind of gets pissed off about the uh, uh, the Emerald Chrome Batman that was gone in three seconds after the bots took over the Funko Shop um, website and ordered you know more. But we're not gonna talk about that because I don't want to talk about it because it pisses me off. Anyhow, <laughs> so I was like. So uh, there's been so many problems uh, with the ECC pops getting to the stores. E C C C. I should make a song out of that, right? Uh, <laughs> getting to the stores, and um, so we can get uh, the shared exclusives. Uh, we've been anticipating them for quite a uh, while since they started announcing the waves and the speculation of what store was going to get. Um, what pop i'm still kind of miffed at that toys r us because i could have got the she hulk but they sold it the day before um the rest of them went online or went live and uh we're still waiting on yandu target what the hell is going on um it's been two days and now officially because it's after 12 it still says coming soon i mean seriously only yandu i have is the one on my chest him right here that's the only thing yandu i've gotten so far so i'm waiting on get, getting that um because i want to add this collection not just because of the eccc it's just a really really cool looking pop so um i know some of you guys are one wanting to get it as well um but so anyhow um i did i was able to order the rick and morty um alien heads um off the hot topic website because i wasn't able to get into the store um so I'm like, okay, I wanted the the saga, the the morning Prince Albert. Uh, print, ooh. <laughs> that wasn't a Freudian slip. <laughs> Prince Rubar. <laughs> That's what, what am I doing? I'm tired. Uh, Prince Robot the Fourth. Um, uh, morning that for, that was a ECC exclusive. And I'm gonna say ECCC, but it, it's probably gonna come out wrong every time I say it. But anyhow. And then um, Barnes Noble also had the uh, the Good Luck Bear as well. So when when they came out on the first, Barnes and Noble, my my particular local store, didn't get any of them. Um, so it was fine. Sometimes it happens. Uh, GameStop didn't get Barb. You know, you can, you can pre-order Barb right now, but GameStop didn't get Barb. Oh, but right. Well, we'll get to that. Um, so I was like, I want those pops. So, but if I can't get them at the store. I can't get them. You couldn't get them online because the website was going on the website. Um, and then, so today I'm driving around, going to another location, and uh, um, I get a text from my friend in California. She's like, and she's from here. She's like, hey, David. My friend just picked up a Care Bear at your Barnes Noble, so you guys must have got them today. I'm like, I haven't heard nothing because there's a local person, a, a local collector who's in our, our Funko Pop group um, who works there. And normally she puts stuff online. I hadn't seen anything. She, she eventually actually did, but I did, I never seen it. So I just rode over there um, to, to get the pop. So when I get in there, you know, they're right back there in the back um, where the most of the customer service, the bookseller representatives, whatever they call it, are uh, back there. Um, doing whatever, and so they're on the table. I can see them. I'm like, oh wow, they, they had a whole bunch of them. Um, and so, but but there's a lot of frenzy going around. I'm like, what, what are they doing back there? So I go up to the table and I grab, you know, first one I get, I, I get the flocked. Um, good luck, bear. Really, really cool. I would never have gotten this unless it was um, Care Bears. I grew up with Care Bears when I was a kid. Um, I think I probably didn't grow up when that they was around, but. Um, I grabbed him or her or it. Um, there's the rest of the line if you guys haven't seen it. I'm like, well, he's kind of cool, you know, and I'll get to this. It is March, it is the uh, um, good luck month, and uh, it's spring, and I'm like, it would be something to have since I, I don't have one. And it is one of the, fir the first physical ECC C pop that I was able to pick up. So I'm like, okay, that's cool. So then I grab the Prince Robot, um, the morning Prince Robot, the fourth, 
Um, and they're all kind of making a big frizzy around. I'm like, what is going on? So I look on the bottom and they took it off. But at the bottom, so you guys check yours. You have Barnes Noble. Uh, they're probably taking care of now. They were marked, they were stickered $9.95. So, um, so the, the three that were back there, they were like, oh, they're wrong, so don't don't take them. Okay, y'all should have took them off the floor and then remarked them. I let them go ahead. I got a work call, so I took my work call. I said, well, go ahead and take mine off. I don't want y'all to say nothing when I get to the front of the store. And so I get to the front and I'm checking out and uh, the young lady who was checking me out, she said, these are still not coming up right. I'm like, they're supposed to be 15 bucks, I think. They rung up 14.95. She's like, well, somebody had a 9.95 stick? I said, yeah, but they're back there taking them off, taking the stickers off the bottom of the box. And so a manager happens to hear what I say, and she's like, we don't take stickers off prices. She's like, what are you talking about? She's like, did they she says, it's 9.95, I don't care what we're doing, let me go back here and take care of this. I'm like, well, I ain't try. I didn't say it, she said that. It had nothing to do with me. And so she ended up giving me uh, the Prince robot. And then see, it didn't come with the um, Emerald City Comic Con uh, exclusive sticker. Um, they said, well, they'll, they'll, they'll send some more with the sticker on it. It doesn't matter. This is the only one you can get from Emerald City. It has the crack in the um, in the his screen so uh, I get I don't know what happened but I got mine for eight nine ninety five minus my ten percent um, Barnes Noble uh, membership card so I got it for like eight ninety five I believe so check the bottom and make sure there's not that yours doesn't say nine ninety five because my store when they got them today they said nine ninety five but I'm so happy to get this one I'm gonna pull him out because uh, the rest of my Saga Pops, you know, you've seen Lion Cat the other day, but the rest of my Saga Pops should be coming tomorrow. And so we'll do a comparison between the two. And this is, this is more, it's not really action figure like. This is more, um, yeah, it's more action figure like than um, pop figure. Uh, really dirty. Um, but yeah, there's just, I see a little dirt spot on there. I didn't see that earlier. The antennas in the back. Uh, this is such a great comic book. I have enjoyed it. And it's funny that the latest comic book has him on the cover. Um, and Because uh, they haven't released one in a long time. So he's on the cover. But I thought that was cool. Yeah, Prince Albert the Fort. I said it again. I... Y'all, come on now. <laughs> why, why is that in my head? What is wrong with me, pervert? Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> the prince. Oh, it's the same damn thing. Not really. Uh, but yeah, so uh, we'll go ahead and take Mr. Good Look Bear out. But we have a lot of pops to go through, and I want to go to bed. Um, and this is the vlog version of this one. Um, uh, the thing is, I don't do cutesy, but this is cutesy. Look at the eyelashes. You know, I know some girls that'll pay for my eyelashes. But um, yeah, <laughs> um, it's, it's just it's different and it's all fuzzy. Oh, it's a little hard on his butt. Huh, how about that? So, <laughs> so um, it's kind of the head's kind of loose on that one. But no, I thought it was cool. I won't get any more of the Care Bears, I don't think. Now that I'm looking at it, it's like, it's really cute. But I don't think like so. I don't do cute. Um, but those are the the first two ECCC exclusive pops, the shared exclusive pops that I got. And then I went on today and grabbed um, uh, the Padme Amidala because um, it was ECCC. And at, at GameStop today, and I didn't know this, it is buy one, get one half off, even on the ECCC exclusives. Um, so if you happen to get, need more than one, and this is the only reason I grabbed her, because I'm like, I needed one more, because I had seven, and I needed six, seven freaking pops in GameStop. So I um, got her, and I had to get her for like, so ends up, they end up making them, if you get, get two, make some nine dollars a piece, roughly. Um, so that was cool. I'm not gonna take her out because we really don't care about that one. So we're gonna start with the Sasha Pop from The Walking Dead. Um, hopefully, um, she'll be at San Diego Comic Con this year, at a, or at a, I think she's gonna be at either Indiana Comic Con. She's gonna be one of the cons that I'm going to this year, and hopefully, I can get her uh, to sign um, this. What wave is 
uh, the, the Walking Dead pops. This is the one that has uh, Eugene, Ezekiel, Richard, and Negan um, in that wave. And I'll tell you guys, I, I don't watch Walking Dead much anymore, but I'm so glad they got rid of Carl's little ass because I couldn't stand his character. Couldn't stand him. But anyhow, there is the Sasha Pop from The Walking Dead. We're not going to take her out either. Um, and then the other one was uh, Dr. Ian Malcolm. Um, and this is from the 25th anniversary Jurassic Park. Um, I am waiting for the Target exclusive of him laying down, trying to be all sexified. People are finding a lot of um, the, I can't read it, the uh, little dinosaur chases. I've been seeing a lot of those pop up online um, recently. So you know, keep a lookout, guys, because the chases of those, which I probably won't get those, are out and about. Um, in your store so keep on looking out for those and then so next one was the big was the big thing for me was when I was at a GameStop just I was just this going to look I wanted the barb they didn't have it the 8 bit barb so I'm just I'm looking then I see the one buy one get one um, half off I'm like oh okay and then I try to warn this guy about buying those um the uh, the twelve ninety nine the, the GameStop mystery boxes from Christmas time he he got like four or six of them and there was twelve ninety nine so he got one you know one half off and I'm like because they didn't have the plastic wrap they just had like somebody had taped it back down with one of those circle tape things or whatever and I was like don't get those they've been through them there's nothing good in those but he was really excited he wasn't trying to hear me I'm like yeah you really get all whole bunch of Ryu's that wasn't even the chase so peace partner but anyhow so um they finally have hit the store i'm lacking um several of those of the avengers infinity war pops and when i tell you some of these are cool now, the iron man is really cool but you guys be careful when you're taking yours out because when i took mine out the the little stand broke so i don't know if i'm gonna i'm gonna, I'm gonna take it back and see if, if gamestop will take it back but if they don't i'm just gonna super glue it yeah because once you pull that bottom thing down because it's inside it's tied together with that piece of plastic if you guys can see that that piece of plastic's there so once you pull it down it breaks it it breaks it if you tug it hard enough it, it breaks the um, the stand from his back. Well, normally the stands are not attached, so I don't know how that happened. I'm not too happy about that. But this, this is, I think this is one of the very few Iron Man, Iron Man pups that I own. Uh, if, if it was glow in the dark, they could have did his eyes. It could have been cool. It might still be. Uh, but it has the wings on the back and the little boosters from. Uh, his boots, and then he's uh, shooting somebody. Almost like like cyborg. But that is the Iron Man uh, Avengers Infinity War pops out. See, and the weird thing is, I don't even know how to get it back in here. Yeah, it was just a bad design getting it in. I mean, having it in there the way it was, and um, and then attaching it to the plastic so you couldn't get it out without breaking the stand so that was one these two i'm kind of not that i'm upset about as the thor and the captain america um, ones because because they look similar they look the same to me i kept on checking my bag to make sure they were different i'm like did i get two captain americans did i get two thors no they're they're so similar and look uh because all the whole you know we got these goatees and beards and things going on now but um the uh i mean he's, he's heavy too uh, this just a normal pop, you know, nothing too uh, different about that. Captain America is Captain America. Um, no shield because you know he lost his shield in Civil War. Um, he's gonna have some type of shield uh, in the movie because we've seen that in the previews and the trailers uh, when he's on Wakanda. 
But he looks so similar. I'm gonna pull his pull his cousin out. Not really his cousin. Um, pull Thor out, so you guys can see. see him first. This Thor with the um, I have, have they figured out which hammer this is? It's not the ult ultimate manure, it's the Jabba horn or Gabba horn. It's not the Gala horn from Destiny. But uh, uh, actually, he looks a little bit better. This pop looks, I know there's a chase version of this. He, he, this pop looks better than the Captain America pop, in my opinion. Um, but it's very, very basic. Very, very basic. Uh, nothing major to this one. Except. Just the face hair, facial hair is different, and it's that, not that much different. So, that they I wish they could have done a little bit better design on both of those, but you know. Is what it is, but the Thor one looks a little bit better. Um, and there's all the, always also a controversy about the uh, is he going to have an eye in the movie or? Because uh, I think the um, the uh, the chase of this Thor is a glow in the dark, or as an exclusive for somebody. I'm not too terribly sure. So if you know know what it is, um, uh, leave a comment down below. And then one of the last ones is Black Widow, the very first Black Widow chase that I've ever chased. Chase on the brain, y'all know how it is. Um, Funko Pop that I've ever owned uh, is um, this one right here, very first one. Uh, I'm not even gonna take her out of the box. It's, 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 it's kind of boring, but again, I, I, I was buying them just to get that that cheaper price. Um, I'm gonna pick up the Hulkbuster and Iron Spider tomorrow. And then I heard that the one, the uh, Thanos, let me get this way first. The Thanos was online on Walmart. The Walmart exclusive version was online earlier. I missed it. Um, but this is out of all of these, uh, Thanos is the coolest one. Or the coolest looking pop. And they put this, so this to be a regular size pop and not a big one. They did a phenomenal job with the size uh, and, ooh, and just the make of Thanos. Uh, they killed it. They killed it with this one. Um, this is like my favorite. If you guys can see, it has all the Infinity Stones um, in there. Uh, so, Oh they have, there's, uh, they have, has the, the, the Finny Gauntlet on his arm. Uh, it has a little muscle texture. Um, and he still looks sinister. About as sinister as he looks. Smooth back. They didn't do anything back there. But this is a big, in a regular size box pop. Like you, you expect it to be a six inch pop and not a three inch and three fourths pop. So there we go. Um, what's that? Thanos. His hands really moving. <laughs> um, for the Infinity, the Avengers Infinity War pops, um, they look great. Like I said, I still have a couple more to get, but this is a good start. I didn't want any of that. I might want them later, the uh, the, the other villains, but um, right now, this is going to be enough for me. So, me and Thanos, we're going to bed, not together, but we're going to bed, and we will see you next time. You guys have a great week weekend, and happy Funko Pop hunting. I hope you get the ECCs. Never mind. Don't ECC me. We'll see you next time. Peace.